Hi guys, today we're on Cape Coral and we're picking up uh, some uh, red devils from this tank from very nice guy Danny G and his crew are helping him here to load them up into this cooler. So we're gonna go and uh, acclimate them at our place and I'll uh, show you where they're gonna go. Probably into a 240 gallon tank until they're big enough to graduate to 5,000. Alright? There's about 30 of them in there. And they tell me that uh, even at this size, which it looks like about 4 to 6 inches, the males already have a hump visible as opposed to the females. Thank you. Thank you, boys. We made it home with the Dovi Eye collection from uh, Danny, G and Mel of Cape Coral. We appreciate it guys. There's about, I don't know, 30, 50 of the Dovi Eye. There was one Oscar. But the rest of them are juvenile Dovi Eye cichlids and they're all gonna go into this 240 gallon tank for now. Okay, everybody's in there, 240 gallon. Doing well as far as I can tell. They're still breathing a little bit hard, but that's because I have just netted them and put them in there. Okay, the last but not least is the Oscar. He's gonna join the Oscar Haven. Eighteen hundred gallon with the rest of the Oscar family. We have already two of the same morph, but that one looks better colored and bigger. Looks older too. I don't know how much time is left in him. Oscars don't live very very long. Usually eight years is, is a very old Oscar. It looks a bit out of it, but I think it'll, it, it will rebound. Oscars are tough cichlids. They can survive unfathomable conditions in our wild Florida, as I showed you before. Surviving in uh, drying pools, pretty much with no water but mud, hot mud. They can still survive even there. Well again, thank you to Danny and Mel and their boys. They're quite the fish lovers over there in Cape Coral. They have about 20 huge tanks between 100 and 150 gallons going. Lots of cichlids. They seem to be the cichlid aficionados. And thank you guys for watching. Bye.